So yeah, it's quite a shithole. Ooh, leather armor. It's heavier than what I'm wearing. Okay, let's hop. Question. Got less durability than what I've got. Ah, god damn it. I'll take the over encumbrance. That's got a value of two. It's got a dump shit that doesn't have any value to it. Scrap metal does have value to it, even though it's got one. We do need it for a second. Sense of module. Lab uniform it doesn't even sell for much, so we'll get rid of that. Same with the jumpsuits. Not much worth to them, so no point picking them up. Ooh, Pudgelist and Illustrated, that's uh hmm, that's a skill that's actually a skill book. I'm surprised we got that so early. In the mailbox as well. Not even like lying out in the open. I wonder if that's like random. Brass knuckles in the up in a nearby thing. Right, so you've got if you're an unarmed build, you've got quite a little thing to help you out at the start. It's not too bad. Not too bad. So yeah, there's only one speed in this game, and that's weapon out and weapon away. Or two. I guess that's two speeds. <laughs> Another newcomer. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. I don't know why, but I like you, boy. Something tells me you're all right. So welcome to Megaton. Just holler if you need something. Creepy. I wonder if that's... I wonder if... Uh, welcome changes if I have, lost, like, really bad karma. Nice hat, Clumsy Jen. So that's the way it's gonna be, huh? That's fine. That's fine. Just as long as we understand each other. This here is my town. These are my people. You so much as breathe wrong, and I'm gonna fucking end you. God, I hope you ain't one of those psychotic quiet types. So, is there anything else I can do for you? I'm looking for my father, middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him. Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. I could use some directions around town. Sure thing, partner. What do you need to find? Uh, actually, I just lied. I don't need... Uh, da -da -da -da. Let's talk about something else. Sure thing. 
Let's discuss this bomb. What about it? Don't you think someone should disarm that thing? I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? You think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? I can see about disarming the bomb for you. Oh, all right. Fine. But listen here. Just take a look at it first. Go easy. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. Fucking fuck. Speech for you. Eh, fuck it. We'll do it. Demolition expertise doesn't come cheap. I want 500. Not an option, I'm afraid. We aren't exactly rolling in cash down here. I don't need a reward. I couldn't sleep at night. No. Hundred caps. All right, I'll take a look at it. Great. Go ahead and see what you can do. Just be careful. Now that I'm helping you, maybe you can help me. I'm looking for my dad. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Had a look in his eye. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Spend some time up in the saloon. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. That man's trouble. You know anything about the area outside Megaton? It's called the Wasteland for a reason. But there are settlements too spread all around. The human race is stubborn like that. To the south you've got Rivet City. But don't bother going to D.C. Place is a war zone. I've got to go. Have a good one. All right, let's see. What's happening? Not much. Can I repair this now, or do I need the quest? I think I, yeah, I need the quest. I call it a quest. It's like an unmarked quest. Twenty-five or higher. I can do that, but not now. I can do it in a bit. Do I am putting points in explosives, even though I'm not using explosive weapons. The ability to disarm mines and explosives is handy, useful. Let's go in here. Here you're that stray from the vault. Oh, I haven't seen one of you for years. Good to meet you. I'm Moira Brown. I run Craterside Supply. But what I really do is mostly tinkering and research. Say, I'm working on a book about the wasteland. It'd be great to have the foreword by a vault dweller. Help me out, would you? Sure, I've got plenty to say about life in the vault great just tell me what it's like to live underground all your life or or to come outside for the first time or whatever strikes your fancy the outside place is amazing in the main room i can't even see the ceiling It was a paradise. Not what the fuck. You know, none of these answers. I don't like any of these fucking answers. I'll go with the stupidest one. Uh, well, no, this <laughs> I'll go with this. Oh, oh my god! It was cramped, dark, and the food sucked. Good riddance. That's terrible. But it'll be great for a foreword. So in that sense, it's great. I think you're gonna like it out here. And here's the armored suit. Just to make sure you don't get recycled into something else's food. That'll be good for the book. In fact, want to help me with the research? I can pay you, and it'll be fun. What's this book you're working on? Well, it's a dangerous place out there in the wastes, right? People could really use a compilation of good advice, like a wasteland survival guide. For that, I need an assistant to test my theories. 
You wouldn't want anyone to get hurt because of a mistake. Nobody's ever happy when that happens. No, then they just yell a lot at me with mean, mean words. Sounds like a great idea. I can't wait to help. Good enthusiasm. Now, I think the first chapter will have to be about surviving day-to-day -day dangers. Things like where it is and isn't safe to find food, the dangers of radiation, and how to avoid and even profit from dangerous landmines. Ooh, sounds like fun, doesn't it? Which do you want to do first? Uh, what about this? What's this about radiation? Well, that's what I need your help for, isn't it? I know lots about it from books, but I never seem to get a live example. Not for long, anyway. So I need you to get a bit of radiation poisoning so I can study its effects. Oh, not a deadly dose, of course. I can fix you up before that. Okay, I'll get radiated. Just be ready to fix me when I get back. Oh, you're a peach. Or at least some sort of hardy fruit that grows in the savagely irradiated mockery of agriculture we have nowadays. Now, 200 rads should be enough for basic sickness. But if you can get 600 or more rads, my test will be even more accurate. Just make sure you can get back here, and I'll see to it that you're well taken care of. Okay, what do you have for sale? What do you need? Okay, what I need is all my, all my shit to be fucking sold. She doesn't have much in the way of money, but whatever. Oh shit! She gave me the she gave me the fucking lever armor. Nice. Okay, so does she have anything worth buying? Uh, ammo. Damn it, she doesn't even have, she doesn't have any 308 rounds. I would have liked some of them to start off with. Whatever. Uh schematics rocket launcher. Fuck that. Go with stim packs. Beer uh I don't really intend on using drugs, but who knows? They need my rides. Fucking hell, it's plus five and plus... plus fucking hell, plus five in this game? God, it's been a while since I've played, played Fallout 3. Good hunting. All right, I'll do me. Come back. Don't have to make any weapons yet. No. Okay, let's uh go over to uh, Apparel. How oh, come I don't have? Oh fuck it, I'll sell that thing in a minute. Go up to this little shithole up here. What do you need? What kind of help around here? Well, it's no secret that the old water treatment plant is on its last legs, and I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. Now, I don't expect much from strangers, but if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks.
How many leaks are there? From the pressure in the plant, my guess is that there are three of them scattered around town. Check along the pipes and the valves, but they might be a bit tricky to spot. I'll keep it in mind. I hope you can help. If folks knew how bad it was getting up here, well, I don't know what would happen. I have to go now. Well, back to work. All right, let's go. I open for these pipes. Pass this one near the start. To fix it. Yeah, look at that. It requires 30 repair to do it. And this is an unmarked quest, so it's very whatever, whatever. I always have trouble remembering where these pipes are. I'm surprised they get they've got a water system in this shanty town anywhere. Where's this last pipe? I could have sworn it was on this side where the bar is somewhere. And every eye shall be blind ah, there it is. I can see it in the distance. Brain water everywhere. Hold the water. There we are. Of the glow. For this ancient weapon of war is our salvation. It is the very symbol of Adam's glory. Let it serve as a reminder of the division that has occurred in the past and the resplendence of the promise of our division in the times to come. Give your bodies to Adam, my friends. Release yourself to his power, heal his blow, and be divided. Something about you, boy. There shall I be no tears, no ways. sorrows, no Here we can, suffering. We or can in the division, sure. we shall see our Check release our from the pain and hardships of this world. Hi. Yay, your suffering <laughs> shall exist no longer. Fucking Jericho grilling that guy. Jericho is a potential companion, but we have to have, like, e evil karma to recruit him. So, no go. I'm going to try and avoid using ca uh, companions. Oh, feeling a bit under the weather? Or a bit over the Geiger counter? 
I'm glad you're finding uh finding this. I'm about as radiated as I can get without burning a hole in the floor. I can tell you're positively glowing. Now just hold on and try not to move. Tell me how it feels, and I'll get you fixed right up. If I listen closely, I can hear my jeans crying. So you're experiencing delusions too. Fascinating. Now, after taking a few notes, I'll take care of that nasty radiation with a bit of my own homemade concoction. I've never had a chance to test it out on someone so heavily dosed, but I'm sure it'll work out fine. <laughs> Exciting, isn't it? Okay, a little Brahmin milk, a couple magnets, and maybe a few happy thoughts. Well, you're alive! Oh, that's the good news. But there was a little side effect. A teeny tiny, um, mutation. Uh, but it seems to be benign, at least. Here, take a few radiation chems, as my little way of saying, I'm sorry I twisted your DNA like a kitten with a ball of yarn. <laughs> My science science effects, advanced radiation, Okay, so it's like ghoulish or something. Ready to continue research on the first chapter. I've got to see how safe it is to scavenge food from one of those huge stores out there. I need someone to research how to travel through a minefield. And that'll cover the first section of the book. Which strikes your fancy? Let's have a look. Uh... Getting food doesn't sound so bad. What are you looking for? Well, food and medicine. Everyone needs them once in a while, right? So they need a good place to find them. There's an old super duper mart not far from here. I need to know if a place like that still has any food or medicine left in it. Okay, I'll check super duper mart. Oh, great. Food is most important, but see if you can get medicine too. And if there's nothing to find, then just come back in one piece, okay? All right. Good luck. Walter, get over here. Huh? Yeah, what is it? Pipes are all fixed. Well, I'll be. The pressure's up in the plant. It looks like all the leaks have been fixed. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. But listen, it's only a matter of time before they burst again. And someone like you might not be around to fix them. I'll make you a deal. I'll give you caps for any scrap metal you can bring me. You'll find it all over the place out there in the waste. If I have a steady supply of scrap, I can keep the plant running and the pipe should be just fine. We got a deal? Uh, sounds good to me. Good. This just keeps looking better. Those parts will keep this place running and the town in fresh water. Hurry back as soon as you find some. What do you need? Uh, I've got some scrap metal. I sure am, Sonny. I'll just take all I have. Well, all right. Let me count out your cap. Hey, hey, and we leveled up as well. Look at that. All right, so. Level three. We'll get our lot pick up to 50. And we'll get our repair to 45. Or 40, I should say. 40. And then we'll get it to 45 by using a gun nut, which gives us small guns and repair skill. I think that's a, that sounds easy enough, doesn't it? I am getting ideas. I don't want to see how you can fucking see through walls, you crazy old fucker. Hey there. Ah, uh, come on, you 
piece of junk. Every day it's the same damn thing. I told you, Gob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave station comes in fine. It's Galaxy News. Their signal's been shit lately. Why won't you work? Stupid radio. Looking for you. Son of a bitch. Don't even think of breaking work. into that. Come on, work. My, my. Just when I had all but given up hope. My dear boy, I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. I am Mr. Burke. Mr. Oh, you, Burke. Well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. That makes you a rather valuable individual. It does. Don't you see? You're a free agent. You have no ties here, no interest in this settlement's affairs. Megaton means nothing to you. I represent certain interests who view this town, this megaton, as a blight on a burgeoning urban landscape. If this settlement were to go away, why, who would really care? Certainly not you or I. Go on, I'm listening. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little <laughs> motivation. I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge constructed for a singular purpose. The detonation of that bomb. You'll rig it to the bomb, then you'll get paid handsomely. What do you say? For an extra 500 caps and you've got yourself a deal. Well played. Oh wow, that actually worked. <laughs> in addition to the base fee when Megaton lies in ruins. Here's the fusion pulse charge. Place it in the bomb. When it's done, meet me at Tenpenny Tower. It's southwest of here, well out of harm's way. You can't miss it. Any questions? Talking a lot, a lot of innocent lives here, but can I warn them? Absolutely not. The place, the people, they're one and the same. Sacrifices for a nobler future. I assure you, they're worth ten times as much in death as they are in life. Messing with that bomb seems pretty technical. What if I can't do it? Lack the aptitude, you mean? You're not rewiring the thing, just attaching the pulse charge to the detonator. If you get stumped, talk to Leo Stahl. He might have something to help you concentrate. He's got a bit of a reputation. Time for me to go. Don't let me keep you. Goddamn radio. You want something or you're just looking to get your ass beat? Now, interesting enough. Making a move? Huh? I find it interesting that there's a that the like the, that the evil option is also the easiest. Doesn't have any stat requirements. You just walk up and press A. But I'm not gonna do that because that's mean. I've got a different idea. I'm gonna find shit for brains over here. Fucking cotton eyed Joe over here. Got my eye on you. Don't do anything stupid. Never. I met a man named Burke. He said he'd pay me to rig the bomb to explode. He said what? Oh, I never did like the look of him. He gave me his fusion pulse charge to rig the bomb. Here, take it. Jesus, give me that thing. Let's go find this Burke character. You're about to get an education in wasteland justice. Okay, I'm, 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 I'm ready. I'm ready to learn ha about Wasteland Justice. I want to see what happens. Hey. He's bunny we're all bunny hopping our way here because the terrain is fucking ridiculous. 